the highlights of the Pioneers going on, taking on the Bulldogs of Wilberforce. And again, Chris Dallas, a heck of a ball game again down there near Cincinnati, Ohio. So let's take you the highlights. Pioneers only beat those Bulldogs by 10 in their previous meeting at home. Jimmy Sherwood out once again. So the Pioneers still without their starting front court there early on. Dallas bucket and the foul for him as well. A good play. How about Robbie Hetherington stepping in for his brother? Nice no-look pass. Looks like TJ on that one. Another one for Chris Douse. How about some more? This time it's Kashat in the corner for Trochio. He had his hand heavily bandaged up, but he seemed to be okay, especially in the later half of the game. In transition, Kashat all the way to Hetherington. Look, nice pass inside. Alexander is going to go behind his head. Pioneers just absolutely rolling in this first half. Mike Carr to Hetherington. Watch a little double clutch. Nice play on the inside. That's going to be a bucket. They had a 30-point lead at halftime. And how about to end it off? Kashat, little alley-oop. Thunder from above from Douse. Pioneers get the big win there. <laughs> Wilberforce sure as heck did make it interesting, though, oh. towards the end. Didn't show you any Wilberforce highlights, but they made it fun. 91-81, 10-6 are the Pioneers. Douse, 29 points, 12 rebounds for him. He put up 74 in two games, Aaron, 74 in two games. Just ridiculous. I mean, what an effort from this guy. And, you know, we heard things when they brought him in as a transfer. You weren't sure what to get, but we're really seeing what Chris Douse is all about just in these past two games and what he's been doing all season. I believe he's up to uh, 14 double doubles on the season. It's just incredible what this guy is able to do. And he's leading NAI Division II in rebounding. I mean, this guy is an absolute monster, a former blue hen there at Delaware State. Initially came out of Nebraska, so he's a corn husker and a blue hen, and now he's a pioneer. What those schools didn't see, the pioneers sure did. I, I think he's definitely benefiting from the NAI game. Uh, to get a powerhouse player the way he is definitely fits in well for the pioneers with that running game, running gun kind of system. The and, system. Know, the, the system. We're kind of making our own guru of go, as we mentioned there, <laughs> the little team video there. But, uh, yeah, Chris Dowse, just outstanding for this Pioneers club. Yet another big day for him. But uh, good to see the team do well with the injuries piling up again. We just, you know, TJ Hedden is going to be out for a little while, and we saw Jimmy Sherwood not play again. So we're hoping this team get healthy. And 305 for Coach Rager, tying the all-time yeah. uh, school wins mark. So congratulations out there to you, Coach. I know you always like to credit your players, so that is very nice. And, you know, Thursday trying to surpass that mark too. It, Thursday, yeah, get pick up number 306 for Coach Rager. And uh, couldn't happen to a better guy. We talked about him. All the credit goes to his players. Uh, just a classy guy, class act all around. And it's going to be a tough matchup on Thursday. And I think we're going to be